In today's Alice lesson, you read about how objects displayed in Alice are covered with texture maps to provide a sense of reality. Let's start Alice and work with texture maps. I'll select the grass template. In this world, a texture map named grass texture is used to cover the ground surface. I'll click on ground in the object tree and select the properties tab. The skin texture property is using grass texture. I'll click on texture maps and you can see that the grass texture image is located here. Let's make some changes to this ground surface. My computer came with some sample pictures. I'll import some of these to try out as texture maps. First, I'll import the creek. Here's what the picture looks like before I import it. I'll click the Import Texture Map button and select the creek and click the Import button. Now I'll drag the creek tile over the grass texture. Let's take a closer look. Now let's add a hill to our scene. I'll click Add Objects. And select Hill. Now we have a hill in our scene. Let's change the texture of the hill. I'll close the gallery and I'll click on Hill in the object tree. I'll import a new texture map from my pictures. Let's try Waterfall. We'll replace the skin texture of the hill with waterfall. Let's take a closer look again. Okay, let's try something else. I'll remove the hill by dragging it to the trash can and change my ground texture. I'll click Import Texture Map again, and this time I'll select Frangipani Flowers. I'll replace my skin texture with Frangipani Flowers. Let's take a look at this one. I like this one. This would be a cool scene for a fantasy world. Here's a fantasy world I created using objects from the Alice Fantasyland Gallery. The sky I used is called Peach Sky and is located in Environments in the Gallery under the Skies folder. Let's try something different. I'm going to get a new world and I'll add an object from the gallery. I'll select Japan Objects and click on Fan Dancer. Let's take a look at her. Let's change her kimono to make it a little fancier. I'll click Done, then I'll select Fan Dancer from the object tree. Let's see what happens when we change the skin texture for the Fan Dancer. I'll import Garden and drag the Garden tile up to the skin texture. Well, that worked for the lower half. Let's see if we can change the upper half of her dress. 
I'll open the Fan Dancer object in the Object Tree and select Upper Body. I'll import the texture map again and drag it over the Skin Texture property. Let's look again. Now I'll open Upper Body in the Object Tree and select Left Arm. This time I'll just select the Skin Texture from the list. Now I'll select the right arm and change the skin texture from the list. Visit our website www.highschoolelearning.com for free interactive lessons and to find out about our fun online courses.